What exactly is kernel task and why does it use so much CPU? In this video, we'll break down all the whys and hows. And if you want to know how to fix kernel tasks high CPU usage, stick around with me as I share a simple step-by-step -step guide. Before we get to that part, make sure to give this video a big like and subscribe to our channel. We'll be sharing a lot more tech tips that you don't want to miss. So let's start by figuring out the basics. What is kernel task? If you've ever tried to diagnose a Mac that's running slow by using Activity Monitor, you've probably noticed a process called kernel task. The kernel is the heart of the Mac OS, the deepest programming level that makes the software and Mac's hardware work. Kernel task handles a number of low-level operations that enable your Mac to function, and most importantly, it manages the temperature of your CPU. Simply put, kernel task tracks what is most likely overheating your Mac. When it notices specific CPU demanding operations, like editing or exporting video at high resolutions, it kicks into action to try and chill your Mac. And in doing so, it generates even more heat. So when you see kernel task high CPU usage, it means only one thing. Your Mac is running hot and trying to protect itself from excessive heat damage. To stop kernel task from using so many CPU cycles, you need to deal with the root of the problem. Now, heat exposure might be external, and your Mac might be poorly ventilated, but most likely it's the CPU intensive processes that cause your Mac to overheat. And here's how you fix it. Open Activity Monitor, but ignore kernel task. Remember, it's not actually using CPU cycles. It's just preventing other processes from using them. Look up the processes that consume lots of CPU. If you find any, use the Quit Process button in the toolbar to shut them down. If this doesn't help, try rebooting in safe mode. Shut down your Mac, Press the power button while holding the shift key. Release the shift key when you see the login window and log in. You may have to log in a second time. You should see safe mode at the top of the login window. Another fix involves restarting your Mac. Just click the Apple icon in the menu bar and select restart. Next up, you can try updating your Mac OS. Buggy Mac OS instances can result in memory leaks and overheating issues. Go to system settings, navigate to general, Software Update, toggle on Automatic Updates. Install any new updates that are available. You can also try updating the apps that increase your Mac CPU load. And I know, the kernel task high CPU bug might be annoying, but most of the time, it's an easy fix. And the only trick you'll need is a restart. And that's it for today. For more ways to speed up your Mac and keep it running smoothly, check out our video on 8 simple tricks. Just click the link over here or find it in the description below. Thanks for watching. And I'll catch you in the next one.